know you guys probably want to hear how great this cleanse has been and how amazing it's been and how easy it is and I honestly what is up guys so I am on my 13th day of my cleanse let's just say i'm halfway there so i'm doing 28 day cleanse for those that you weren't following along i'm getting rid of sugar liquor i'm keeping track of my calories making sure that they're at 1800 calories a day not going over that and then also getting a minimum of eight hours of sleep so i thought i would update you guys on that because i just thought of something earlier today i actually have a tasting to do for my work because they just changed over their menu so they need us to do a tasting which means I'm probably going to be breaking a lot of my rules. So my tasting's tomorrow, and yeah, I didn't really think about that, so I don't know. I'll still be, I won't be avoiding liquor at all because they're gonna be doing wine tastings as well as the food. I guarantee there's gonna be sugar involved because I don't know, maybe there's added sugar to a lot of things, but like, we'll see. This is my angel. <laughs> So those are some things that you can't really avoid, but it is what it is. I'm still gonna like be more conscious of it throughout the month and stuff like that, but technically I haven't been 100% true to it, which is kind of sucky, but like also I've had good results so far, so I'm not like totally bummed out by the whole thing. So you guys probably want to hear how great this cleanse has been and how amazing it's been and how easy it is. And I honestly was having an okay time with it until the other day. And like, I've just been really busy. So I haven't been making videos every single day. Like I said, I was going to, and that was like, that's just been part of the challenge. But I honestly, on the other night, I had like a really rough day. Like I had a, just a terrible headache all day and I just like didn't know what it was. I, there was like pressure on my head and I was like this is the weirdest thing so I broke down and had a coffee just thinking it might be a caffeine headache and then it came back a little bit later in the day so I ended up taking a Tylenol which I never do but that helped and then that night I had zero like I had maybe four hours of sleep like I don't know why but I woke up at 2 30 in the morning and couldn't get back to sleep which was like the worst so I've suffered from insomnia since I was like 15, yeah, about 15 years old. So I've always suffered from insomnia and of course it comes back and I'm like, okay. And the next day I had to work a night shift. So I was up since 2.30 in the morning and then I had worked till 1 a.m. So I was like just so out of whack the next day, like on Friday, like I was just like, couldn't make sense of anything. I think I slept, I slept until 2 p.m. Uh, and then I literally had so much stuff going on like just to like wrap up my week. So I just couldn't make any videos. There was no possible way. And I've been pr trying to prioritize my sleeping because that's just so important. And I made a video about that um, in previous videos. So I'll link that below just to explain why it's so important to get sleep, especially if you're trying to lose weight. And so I was trying to prioritize my sleep over everything. And then tomorrow I'm like, I work 11 and I probably won't get home till like nine or 10. Yeah, after I didn't get sleep, I hated my life. Like I was like, screw this, screw the gym. Oh, and this entire week. To top it all off, I didn't go to the gym except for one day. I only went once and I've just been like feeling like a little lard ass. I'm like, this sucks so much. Just Every time I go to the gym, I just feel so much better, but I've just been lacking on sleep. And that's been like my number one priority is just trying to get enough sleep. And then on top of that, like I just, yeah. So I just didn't get to go to the gym either. And I was just like so annoyed about that. Like I was just like, this is ugh, so frustrating. And then Cleo woke me up one day and she started puking everywhere. She was getting sick and I'm like, okay, awesome. Like let's just throw it in there and I hated my hair I painted my nails like this ugly green color I took it off because I couldn't stand it I was like driving I just couldn't stand it I was like everything I was just so mad and just like you know you get so annoyed and you're like I can't do anything about it that was like my last two days so anyways <laughs> I was just like having a fit and then I finally got back on track so last night I finally got like a normal sleep and I was just like this is what I needed. Yeah, it was like, a, just insomnia kills me and I'm gonna make a video on how to conquer insomnia because I have some tips and tricks about how to do that because I've suffered from it for so long. And that's pretty much my update. I don't really have anything interesting. This is probably gonna be one of the most boring videos of me because I sat here the entire time. So until next time, I'll see you guys then.